So alright, so first and foremost, I want to give our praises to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yomshai, Ba'ashem, Rekha Kodash. You see, the man said, Pastors and elders are great, most of them well. Our teachers are pastors in the shoot. You see, salutations, holy alchemy, so they push one of the truth and say, Dean and the out, you know, continuing season and season with the Shalom. You know, once again, going to tell a little video here, they're basically touching upon um, this art news article that, that I saw, I saw it yesterday, right? And um, I was even explaining this situation to some people, you know, just to hear the, the point of view, you know? And, um, um, it's also showing that really and truly that Esau would Esau would, would would never accept no lovers. It's just simple as that. And you know, I ended up in a conversation with two people last night, and just 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 um explaining to them that 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 Jake just look for acceptance. Just look for acceptance from 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 the enemies. You can't get that from our enemies. You understand? Know, so and some of them. Some of them, are, um, the, the people also have any conversation, they agree. Some of them bring out some good points as well. Even, even if we're talking about, you know, the Meghan, um, the Meghan Markle situation with, um, with the king and the, um, with the queen and the prince and, and she sons, whoever it is. And yeah, yeah, I was telling them, I say, you all find it strange that, that she don't like, um, she don't like, um, um, black people. That ain't, that ain't supposed to be strange for you. That is history proven that by just the fact that you all want to be accepted from these people, you all do everything. You all try to even forget. It's how Jake said, I just want to forget slavery happen. You understand? It had, it, it had people that, it had Jake that want to, in the mind, there's even tell you, I hear them say that, that, that slavery is in the past. I hear that, I see that, I see people write it, you know? That is in the past, forget that man. People change. That is that is the mentality, and that is why certain things like this have to happen. Because you, Jake's continue trusting the enemy, right? It's a um, it's a, so let's go go into the article now. It's a black kid bullied by white kids and forced to drink urine at sleepover. First and foremost, as a parent, you're not supposed to be sending your child to to a no sleepover with no with no. Um, group of Edomites, you understand? You're supposed to be again. If you if you're reading and watching the news, you would get to understand why I would say that. Because recently, it it had so much a post recently that where a a a, a black woman went a sleepover or went a went a um a night out with some Edomite woman and she she showed up missing. You understand? She was missing. Up to I think up to now they didn't find her, right? Or they find her dead. With lungs missing, or it is, you know, sound like these Edomite women must you, you know, obviously they believe in witchcraft. So what they must you do, do on her is um and sorcery, right? But she she again she should have dead or missing. Nothing came out of it. It had some other situations where um some some other jigs they end up missing and up dying, going to sleepovers and so going to do sleepovers with Edomites. So you. We didn't you seeing this online, you know, because at the end of the day, it have no way they could tell it that they didn't see it. Because that was posted all over. That was a big conversation. And you know, these people love to be on the internet. They love to browse the internet, so you, sh you should be seeing it. So you, your, 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 the first red flag there is sending your child in a, in, a, in a sleepover full of his enemies. Right? They are not his friends. They are his enemies. Right? It's a, it's a black kid bullied by white kids and forced to drink urine and sleep over, right? Uh, it's a hundred of protesters congregated outside a Plano police department Friday, March 5th in support of a local 13-year-old black boy who was reportedly the target of brutal bullying, which is not, that is not bullying. That is just hate. You understand? That is just hate. People have to realize that. That is not bullying. That is, that is called bullying. That is hate. Right? There's a hate to, to 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 an next person. There is it have no bully in there. Why did why didn't they bully the other the other kids at the sleepover? Why did they only bully him? Right? It's a brutal bullying at his nearby middle school. The family of Samarian Humphrey is demanding justice be served after after they say Humphrey endured a hate crime at the sleepover with his classmates. Right? Um it say a viral video originally posted on to Facebook come free can be seen being forced to drink a, a yellow substance at a sleepover. Now remember this is a sleepover. 
the person who even the sleep over it, where, where are his parents? His parents was right there. And they made that happen. Is it to show you that that is hatred? How, how could you trust your enemies? Fuck. Sorry, so, pardon my friends, but how the fuck you could do the... Uh, 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 and I just show you how, how, how stupid some of these, these Israelites are outside here. It is, it, these so-called white people, they would never love you all and they would never accept you all. Stop looking for acceptance there. This is, um, so let me jump to our scripture here. This is the book of Ecclesiasticus, right? Chapter, chapter 12. This is the book of, book of Ecclesiasticus, chapter 12, verse 10. Now, the book of, the book of Ecclesiasticus, Ecclesiasticus is the book of Surak, which is in the Apocrypha, right? So, this is um, Ecclesiasticus, chapter 12, verse 10. It says, Never trust thine enemy, for like as iron rusted, so is his wickedness. So, how could you trust your enemy? This is throughout history, throughout proven history, right? These people can never be your friends. They're your enemies. Your, your, your friend wouldn't put you in slavery. Your friend wouldn't murder you on the streets and, and, and make it and feel like murdering you. It's a good thing, right? It say, never trust thine enemy, for like as iron rusted, so is his wickedness. So it say, never trust thine enemy. You see, your first red flag is sending your, your child to a sleepover with a, a sleepover full of Edomites, full of white people. Right? Again, if you watch the news, you'll see how much things happening in sleepovers where Jake's and Jake showing up missing, they're showing up dead, um, and all these sort of stuff. So why are you doing that for? For acceptance? So it's a, in a viral video originally posted to Facebook, Humphrey can be seen being forced to drink a yellow substance at a sleepover as his white classmates giggle and tease him. That is not bullying, that is just hate. They hate you. Why, why, why didn't they bully the rest of people that was by the, any sleepover? It's a Humphrey's mother, Summer Smith, believe the drink contained urine and says her son was shot with a bb gun and called racial slurs during the nightmare slumber party so if it was a bullying why they call him racial slurs and all these other things that is a hate that is hate they just they just they, 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 hey i just could just say they go extra they go straight from the womb these people would not love you they, they would not they, they don't have they have no friendship there that is your enemy, your natural born enemy. It's the same way every animal have an enemy, a particular enemy towards the the the, the towards the life. The Edomite and Jake, they, they cannot be friends, it's natural enemies. <laughs> so it's say what? Never trust the enemy, for like as iron rusted, so is his wickedness. Though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him. It say take good heed. You see, do you go crouching? It, 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 to you, it might sound right. To you, they might come to you sounding like if they want to be a friend, but they are not. As again, as history proven, this this person can never, this, this so-called white man can never be, can never be trusted. Since when sending your child to a, 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 a sleepover full of either mice is a good thing. Think about it. Oh, is a sleepover happening in a house, right? So obviously, the, the 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 kid parents must be there. So why didn't the kid parents stop this? Why didn't they stop this? <laughs> hey, and that again, that is just Jake being foolish, right? That's just Jake being foolish. There's so much information showing you how the cops, doctors. Laws, they plenty, plenty. The many KKK. You sending your child a full blown either might slumber party is the first flag. Obviously, something won't happen to, to him. That child could have been killed because the dad him drinking urine. It say and his, and says his son was shot with a BB gun and called racial slurs during a nightmare slumber party and they tape it. They paid on online. They tape it and they paid online. So he said, though he humble himself, um, Ecclesi book of Ecclesiastes chapter 12 verse 11, he said, though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him, and thou shalt be unto him as if thou hast wiped a looking glass. 
and thou shalt know that his rust had not been altogether wiped away. He said, oh, watch them. He rust and wipe away, meaning he wickedness and wipe away. He wicked, the wickedness there. Hmm. So going back, going on in the article, this, well, this is the video here. I ain't gonna play the video, but because the device I using a little old and it could start to stick, right? But, um, you, see, you can see from the pit here that you see right now, you see them have them drinking the, the pee. And they say, what? Well, and they, this person put crying and crying, uh, crying and what FBA student has been terrorized by white students and, and play no ISD did nothing. Obviously, they would not do nothing because they for their own. A Edomite would be for his own. You see, suspect suspected white supremacist thugs invited him to a sleepover where he was beaten shot with bb guns and forced to drink their urine you understand if, and yeah they invite him they invite him to the sleepover but it's his mother sent him there and i just to show you how foolish and simple we people is that they believe that that that, that they could be friends with these people you see how horrible must you be? This is not a prank. This is beyond bullying. You are evil. They are evil. Smith said during a press conference, yeah, because that is your enemy. What 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 do you expect them to do? Show your love? Hmm. I'm jump to our scripture here. Um to Psalms. See if I get it here. Oh, I had to say Psalms 83, right? Psalms 83, I'll start from verse 1. It says, Keep not thou silence, O God, hold not thy peace, and be not still, O God. For, for lo, thine, thine enemies, thine enemies make a tumult, and they that hate thee have lifted, lifted up the head. They have taken crafty counsel against thy people and consulted against thy hidden ones. They said, Come and let us cut off cut them off from being a nation, and that, that the name of Israel may, may be no more in remembrance. So uh, this the point I want to bring out here is say for low thy enemies. So they, so these people are gonna be listed here. It's not a friend. So you're not gonna no sleep over them. Now you're gonna go no sleep over them. This is your enemies, right? He said, for they have consulted to, together with one consent. They are confederate against thee. The tabernacles of Edom, and I will stop right there because that is who I wanted to bring out. They said the tabernacles of Edom, right? This, these are, the, these are what, 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 when you read all the script, that you want to illustrate who is your enemies, right? It have more. It have more. But Edom, is the, Edom, the tabernacles of Edom, they put Edom first. They put Edom first. So Edom being an enemy and Edom is the so-called white people today. This, them, them is the enemies. So how could they trust them? How could they expect anything different from them? They say the school district has responded with a statement saying it does not condone bullying, harassment, and or threats against any student due to the legal restrictions regarding the confidentiality of student information. Plano ISD is unable to release the specific student information, but it can, it can confirm appropriate measures were promptly taken to protect the victim and to investigate the allegations. What more What more investigation there is than, than a tape and it and upon fucking Facebook? And I just to show you again. Is it? The enemies, they, they love one another. So why would they why would they actually do something good for you? <laughs> so this is it. The statement reads, it is the district's hope and expectation that all parties work, right? To to create a climate of mutual respect even in the midst of holy fuck you can have agreement when somebody don't have this sun drinking pee. <laughs> again, again. <laughs> Never trust the enemy for like it's iron rusted, so is his weakness. Again, pardon my French because I was just have this, you know, this happened in that conversation yesterday. I know you get to see how what Jake, which what Jake Miners 
that 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 they believe that these people is a friend. <laughs> hey, it say so. Go jump back in, into the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter twelve, verse twelve. It says, "Set him not by thee, lest when he had overthrown thee, he stand up in thy place. Neither let him sit at thy right hand." And I tell him here, yeah, don't make an enemy. Don't do this towards the enemy. You see. It say neither let him sit at thy right hand, lest he seek to take thy seat. And thou at and thou at last remember my words and be and, and be pricked therewith. Who will pity a charmer that is bitten with a serpent, or any such as come nigh wild beast? Right? And this your mark up, you say what? You say do set a matter right hand. And all these things, so never again, never trust the enemy. You could trust the enemy. Like, it, you know, all these things, all these things Jesus have to do, like history on his social media every day. Something happened, they posted it, but they will still want to send their son a sleepover full of Edomites. <laughs> it, again, it will never have no kumbaya moment with Esau. It will never have to no come together with Esau. It, never, it will never have no we are the world and all this shit. shit. With Esau, there is a natural born enemies. Right? And the scriptures tell you who is the enemy that will bring on the Psalms. And it starts straight with Esau, the tabernacles of Esau. I'll bring on this last scripture here and I will close off. Right? This is the book of Ecclesi um, Ezekiel. Ezekiel chapter 35 verse 5 I said because thou has thou has had now when you read from the from verse 1 come down you can see talking about Esau right but jump into verse 5 you say because thou has had a perpetual hatred because thou has had a perpetual hatred and has shed the blood of the children of Israel by the force of the sword in a time of the calamity, in a time that had that the iniquity had an end. So it said, because thou has had a perpetual hatred. When you look up the word perpetual, it means everlasting, ever continuing. You understand? That way it means. So that that hatred is is everlasting, never ending. So that hatred that, that the so-called white man have for you all, it, it will never end. It will always be there. It have no come together. It have no come together. No matter how much times you all jigs try to bring equality. Let us come together. Let us be it will never have that. It will never have that. Because it's written here, they have a perpetual hatred for you all. Perpetual hatred means ever perpetual means everlasting. That hatred there forever until the end. Right? <clears throat> so with that, once again when you give our praises to Yahweh Ba Shemi or Shai Ba Shema Kakodash. We said about the apostles and elders of great must not rule well and citations only I come to the push we don't treat and say Dean and the out. No constant season on season we say shut up one.